I believe that Jesus was born to bring a message of God's love to, to a troubled and a hurting world. And that message continues to be delivered this Christmas time. Sacrificial love, giving up love, is love that is willing to go to any lengths to provide for the well-being of the beloved. And you are beloved of God. In 1 Corinthians 13, verses 4 through 7, it says, Love is patient. Love is kind. Love is not jealous. Love does not brag. It is not arrogant. It does not act unbecomingly. It does not seek its own. It is not provoked. It does not take into account a wrong suffered and it does not rejoice in unrighteousness, but it rejoices in the truth. It bears all things. It believes all things. It hopes all things, endures all things. True love, it's more than a feeling. It is a decision to do what is required to make love last through good times and hard times. When love is transformed into all kinds of acts, acts of kindness, and those acts are both large and small. Real love is patient, it's understanding, it's consistent, and it's considerate. Love is an enduring race, a journey that requires ample servings of faith and forgiveness. God wants more for you than just a mediocre relationship with your family and friends, especially to be experienced this Christmas. God created you to give and to receive true love. Yes, real love requires effort, but God will equip you for that work because God knows that the fruits of your labor will enrich not only your life, but also the lives of your loved ones and generations yet unborn. I pray that you're equipped with the love of God this Christmas. I pray that you feel it. I pray that you express it. I pray that you give that first ahead of every gift materially that you give to others. God bless you and Merry Christmas.